This is Fred Beck from Fred Talks Fighting, proudly sponsored by Empire Fight Store and joined by Wade Plemons. Wade, you commentated a Floyd Mayweather fight. That's pretty good. Man, it's, it's, it's legendary stuff that's going on in my life, and I just want to say everybody that's watching Fred that also watches my channel or just watches Fred's channel, thank you guys for allowing us to do what we do, man. And Yeah, I, I can't describe it. It's not really set in yet. Maybe when I get on the flight in about four hours, because that's when I have to get on my flight. <laughs> what time, what time is it? we got to get the videos done, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But yeah, no, it's, I don't know what to say, man. I'm, I was talking for eight hours straight and I'm at a loss for words. I'm blessed. You can speak right now. Your voice is good. Yeah, yeah. Listen, I, I don't know what held it on. I think the fact that uh, I was not speaking as much during the Tommy fight probably helped. But uh, yeah. That sounds pretty nice. And we'll talk about Floyd May versus Deji. Floyd, obviously, he's playing with him in there. But then he got him out. Was it the fifth, sixth round? I think it was the sixth. Yeah, I'll have to go back and look. But yeah, at a certain point, Floyd was going to do that. It was really just a matter of when he decided to do it. Mm. And yeah, that's what happened, man. Deji walked into some and I think fair stoppage by referee Kenny Bayless. Legend, by the way. But Floyd could have got him out there in the first if he'd wanted to, but Floyd so. was kind of, kind of playing with him. Yeah, no, I mean, <laughs> putting on Floyd a show. Was, Floyd was <laughs> dancing. He was the ring card girl at one point. He was. Speaking Deji's of ring coach. cards, look at this. Oh, yeah, we got the fifth round. Which, That's pretty cool. Which was, a, which was a round where Deji landed. There you go. Was around where Deji landed, so there you go. That's a little good luck there, but oh uh, yeah, it is what it is. Um, Deji did what he could. That's all you can really say. He did what he could, and he should be proud. He should be very, very proud. I, I saw Deji's mother there ringside. God dang, my heart almost broke. She she came up and put her, like, held my hand and said, "Thank you for doing this." And I was like, "You shouldn't even know who I am." And I was like, "Thank you." And your kid's son, lovely. She's amazing. A, an amazing woman, and yeah, it was just it was surreal to see. And he did his very best, man. That's all you can ask for. Where does Deji go from here then? Wherever he wants, man. That's that's the beauty of this thing is you fight Floyd, now the world, and it already was, but now the world is his oyster. Badu Jack walking through as well, my man. Um, no, literally, the, the world is his oyster. He can do whatever he wants, and it's going to be everybody now coming for Deji. That's what happens when you get to the top of this game. The target's on his back. You're going to see the names. I'm probably going to predict it here for you. You're going to see the Bryce Halls. You're going to see the Jay Swinglers, which I actually like that fight a lot. Yeah. You're going to see a lot of the guys in this scene start to call him out. And fair play, that's the game. Mm, certainly. I can see Floyd's about to come through the press room now, so I've got a whiz, but who does Floyd, where does Floyd go now from here? Uh, he's doing whatever event like this he wants. He's got YouTube in the palm of his hand now, so he can get Jake, he can get KSI, all those guys that makes dollars and makes sense. Awesome. Thanks, Wade.